So it's Monday, CMA Fest week begins. Tens of thousands of rabid country music fans take over downtown Nashville to see the biggest stars, maybe even future stars. Peyton Kennedy joins us now as a preview and some of the uh, roads that you'll want to avoid. And Neil, the 51st CMA Fest features four days and nights of nonstop music at Nissan Stadium, Ascend Amphitheater, and stages throughout the downtown area. So night one at Nissan Stadium alone features big name artists like Jordan Davis, Leonard Skinner, Ashley McBride, and Thomas Red. And as always, in addition to the music, there will be special meet and greet moments with artists at Fanfare X that's happening inside Music City Center. Superstar Dolly Parton kicks off Fanfare X on Thursday morning for a sold out crowd and tens of thousands of people from all 50 states and around the world will be navigating through the downtown area on foot, scooter and by car. But it is important to note the first road closures began last Thursday and many more are on the way. Today at 7 a.m. Broadway between 1st and 2nd Avenue will close and at 9 a.m. 1st Avenue between Demumbrian and Church Street will close. Both will reopen by 3 a.m. next Monday the 10th. And the next round of road closures go into effect on Wednesday, primarily involving 1st and 2nd Avenue and the roads around them. So we do have a full list of the road closures already in place and what more is to come. That's up on our website, WKRN.com. Live in Nashville, Peyton Kennedy, News 2. All right, um, and a reminder, if you're going to the nighttime shows, they're building a new Nissan Stadium, so the parking is very, very limited, and you'll want to research that mm -hmm. before you head out. We will, of course, keep you up to date on all the CMA Fest stuff happening in downtown Nashville right on through the weekend. Tune in as CMA Fest begins.